Hello everybody, you are set for a beautiful treat today with the Power of Love cards. Now these would have to be the most powerful Oracle deck cards that I actually own. They may look very simple, but they pack a punch. I really consider James Van Prague to be one of the most giving mediums that is on social media. So if you haven't followed him, I'll put his links down of his social media links. Definitely go and follow him. He is very positive, very giving, and very knowledgeable. Now these this deck I've had since 2016. I will put the link in the description box below, but I've learned so much with this deck. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the cards up. They're beautiful, colorful, colorful cards. They don't look that much, but as I go through them, I really want to discuss true readings that I did with the cards and really show you how powerful this deck is. So let's get started. Let me move this over here. Put them up here. They are, and we want to talk about the cards. People love to hear about the cards. They are shiny stock. They're easy to shuffle. They are the standard Hay House card deck. They are gloss. That is the reverse. Nice, thick, easy to shuffle. 44 cards in the deck. This is the book, as always. Very good, sturdy book. Alphabetically done. The cards itself have a full page. They have the photo of the card, the full description of the card, what you need to know. Beautiful. As I said, I love this deck. It's one that pops out every so often. This is going to be my most, or one of the most dog-eared, well-used decks that I own. So let me put the cards. I'll go through them very quickly. You can slow down the recording if you wish. I won't discuss the, these cards, but I will discuss the two at the end that you may find interesting so do you have these cards i don't see many people using these cards um i, I don't know why They're, i find them brilliant um to connect with great lessons they pack a punch they do pack a punch so they're colorful they're bright fantastic messages to be honest, you could actually even just own the guidebook that comes with these cards and really learn you know, self-development. Brilliant, brilliant teacher he is, James Van Prague. I've just done a live with this deck. I'll put the link in the description box if you want to see how the cards worked. So there's 44 cards, bright, colourful, rainbow. You know, some people may find them very basic, but I tell you, as I said, the book itself, they pack a huge message. A bit like chocolates in a box. You don't know what you're going to expect, you know, until you open it up and, <laughs> and see what it is. And then, you, you know, you're sort of like, pow, you know. So they're a definite gift, definite gift. The power of love. Beautiful oracles. Oracle messages. So I am going through the card deck very, very quickly. If you need to slow it down, you can change the pace of the video to half. I can get asked what crystal that is in the background. Do you know what crystal that is in the background, the tall one? So we're nearly at the last two cards. When I get to the last two, I want to just discuss, give you an example of what's come up in a reading and how I've used the cards. So there we go. So one of the cards I want to really discuss about is something that I learned. And at the time I was going through judgment of everybody, you know, like probably in ego, thinking I was too big for my panties and, you know, thinking I was the greatest thing that on that worked on this earth and I was probably a bit full of myself as we all go through stages in our lives you know we're constantly learning and growing and this card popped up discernment discernment and really taught me a lot about judgment and the difference between discerning something and the difference between judging something so it was very I will always remember the day that I pulled this card and how powerful the lesson was to me let me read you the book itself 
and how it fit, fit you know fitted into my lesson one of the hardest lessons to grasp while living in this physical dimension is the art of discernment life is a series of choices and you'll always want to make the right one for your soul's evolution discernment is not judgment discernment is living your life with the recognition of what is in alignment with your unique path when you are centered in your being and aware of your own power you're able to see the love and truth in everything and everyone intuition is the language of your soul so it is imperative that you understand how your soul speaks to you and the best ways for you to do so is to listen when you utilize discernment in your daily life choices become easier and manifesting the best possible outcome doesn't seem like a matter of chance the wonderful shakespeare adage to thine own self be true encapsulates discernment perfectly remember what seems important to you may not be to someone else so when you use discernment understand what it is for your own benefit and growth and what is beneficial to you on your path to self-acceptance ripples outward to those around you when you know yourself love yourself and honor who you are you become aligned with your divine self when this happens you only attract good into your life so that was a very powerful lesson for me at the time now this card here just popped up tonight in a reading when i pulled this card i read the message in the book that was fine but then i knew the person that i was reading the card had gone through a lot a lot gone through hell and back and it actually brought tears to my eyes knowing this person has gone through a lot and she really needed to cry and release that and really know she was ready for joy and it the story was the lady had just gone through a domestic violence very very rough very tough so she didn't feel like she deserved joy so the message was so strong so heartfelt from source it was beautiful and it was a beautiful lesson to her knowing that you know with everything that she's been through and she went through so much and she really was the strength for her kids that she deserves now to be happy so it was just a beautiful lesson so this is this deck hard case box as always with hay house got the thumbnail if you want me to read the back i would do so push it over there shall i just do the reverse there of the deck no we'll put the joy on the deck so lovely lovely deck I think everybody who does any type of reading with cards should get this. I think it's a really good deck to really kick you up the bum when you need to hear from your ego. Now, the back of the reverse of the deck says your goal while inhabiting human form is to make manifest love in this physical dimension this 44 card deck a labor of love created by internationally renowned medium james van prague serves as a reminder of the reason why you are here the cards have been channeled from james's guides and master teachers in the spirit realms in order to reactivate and expand an aspect of your soul that might have been unconsciously hidden deep down within you just pull one card each morning to focus on for the day or use the champion or companion book to become adept at creating activation spreads for yourself, friends or clients. By utilizing the power of love activation cards, you are telling the universe that you're ready to see the tapestry weaving through your soul and all the souls you interact with. Love knows no limits. This is the power that holds everything together. Activate this innate force that dwells inside you and be empowered. And it's so true because the more that we work on each other, the happier people are around us. So I hope that you, you know, if you don't, if you have this deck, I hope that you dust it off and maybe use it today for a reading. Um, they are, it is still available for sale. I'll put the link in the description box. I think it's a great book that comes with it. As I said, I actually enjoy the book more than the cards <laughs> because the messages here are so beautiful. So I hope that you enjoy this deck review that I've done today. Until next time, don't forget to like and subscribe and comment below.